good morning. It's another day. We're on the road again. So today I'm headed not to an install, but I'm headed to Minneapolis to get a load of lumber. So on the way, I'm going to stop just south of Bemidji and look at a kitchen there that they want to remodel and uh, put new cabinets in. So me and was on the way. Decided we would combine it into that trip. And then on the way home tomorrow, I got to go to a class for my drone pilot's license. So we're going to get all of that done here in a couple of days and be back home. Gonna be a lot of miles on the road. Hopefully the trailer holds up. Got a couple of tires that aren't brand new anymore, so hopefully we don't have any flats along the way. We'll take you along for the ride. We've been traveling long, travel's going all right. Everything's making out except that the trailer lights are working intermittently, so I had to borrow this truck and the plug is dirty or bad or something. So I have to make a stop here, get the parts I need and see if I can get it fixed. Don't really want to get in the city without lights in the trailers. I think we're good to go. We'll give her a shot and see what happens. Well, it's three o'clock now. We left home about six this morning and stopped at the customer's place. So we've been traveling for a few hours and I think I got about a half hour left into the lumber yard. We'll get loaded up. We are here, got her on. I didn't tarp it because the tarp wants to flap around in the wind and it's not raining, so I'm just gonna run with it. If it looks like it's gonna rain, we'll tarp it then. But I've got tire it's a little low over here. We'll get that fixed up. Well, I did that thing again. They're almost out of fuel. I really don't want to walk. <laughs> not here. So we're gonna see if we can find somewhere to get fuel. There's some truck stops and whatever around here. Just a question of whether or not I can find out how to get into them. This truck and trailer, I can't get into this anywhere. So, and we'll see if I can do all that before I run out of fuel. That's the worst part about being in the city, especially with the truck. You can see where you want to be, but you can't figure out how to get there. So that's why I live in the middle of nowhere where I do. If I see somewhere, I can just drive there. It's not getting any better. We can only hope. We're getting closer. I can see the sign. I think this road gets me there. I'm not walking yet. Just pulling into the pump and the low fuel light comes on. Perfect timing. It means I didn't waste time getting fuel before I needed it. That's one reason I don't own a diesel. Imagine filling that up every day. How many gallons are it gonna be? Take a guess. Leave in the comments. It auto shut off at 100. I guess we'll never know. Somebody stopped and told me I need to get to shelter. Problem is the truck isn't shifting. So I'm sitting here in first gear and it doesn't want to go. So we'll see if we make it. I sort of tarped the load real quick. I didn't video that because I was in a hurry. But uh, let's see if we can at least get to a motel so we can tarp it properly before this storm hits. I only got about 10 miles to go. I should have not stopped. I should have ran for it. But got a good bit of lumber on there and I really didn't want to be wet. As long as you don't get any too strong winds until I get the tarp properly or we don't get any hail. I'm puttering along at 40 miles an hour so hopefully we can get somewhere get a little bit of shelter anyway. This is not looking pretty in front of me. Some black clouds. I turn around and go back, but it's moving this direction pretty fast, and I can't go very fast. I only got a couple miles to where I need to be. I'm 
hopefully we'll make it. Some kind of ugly storm. Three miles to go, it says. Let's see if I'm gonna make it. Pretty ugly. Oh, you must have went in there. Yeah. So much of my turban to go, it's all blowing off. Might help me a little bit dry, but we're just here hanging out. Well, we survived the night. Beautiful weather today. A few clouds, 60 degrees, sunshine. Day after a big storm. We've been headed home, beautiful day, the truck is running great, and all of a sudden it did the same thing it did me the other day, so we gotta try to figure out what's going on here. Here's a new fuel filter we just put on. I don't know anything about these things. Well, disconnected the batteries, hooked them back up, we'll see if that fixed it. I don't have much hope, but we're going to find out here in a second. We'll give it a try. Well, we're moving. Check engine light stayed on, but we're up over 20 miles an hour anyway, so that's something. Well, it's doing it again. In limp mode, but we are moving a little bit, so I guess we'll keep going, see if it gets better. Well, we're still moving along. The truck seems to be running okay at the moment. It's having its its moments, but we're we're still traveling. We'll keep moving. We've got a couple hours to go. Hopefully, be home about eleven. Haven't had a good meal this whole trip. Thought I would get one here. Nothing's open. So, yes, nation burrito, cheese curds, yogurt. There's a gut bomb combination for you. I made her home last night, got home about 11 o'clock. I was tired and went to bed. I get up and it looks like it's half unloaded. You guys must have worked late. I got her all unloaded. There and there, and there, and there, and the pile over here. And the pile on there. We gotta figure out where we're gonna put that stuff. But it's inside, so for rainproof. We got her done. There it is. Home safe. Everything worked. Thanks for watching.